Call our meeting to order. Please stand to salute the flag. Well, after we salute the flag, just remain standing for a moment of silence, if you would. Doug, would you lose? Sure. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Roll call. Chairman Clackenbush. Present. Legislator Diamond. Present. Legislator White. Present. Legislator Beniak. Present. Legislator Dutessi. Present. Legislator Wheeler. Here. Legislator Isabel. Here. Legislator Kuchis. Here. Legislator Kelly. Present. Okay, privilege of the floor. Um, first, we have public comment, then we have a presentation from Patrick Clear. Uh, from Montgomery County Water Quality Committee. But first, public comment. Anyone from the public wishing to speak, uh, this is your opportunity to address the legislature. Hearing none, we'll close public comment, and I'll ask Mr. Clear if he would uh, give us his annual report. Yes, thank you very much for putting me on the agenda tonight. Uh, my name is Patrick Clear. I'm chairman of the Montgomery County Water Quality Coordinating Committee. For the new legislators here who haven't seen me do this presentation before, uh, the Water Quality Committees were established in 1991 as a requirement of the Federal Clean Water Act were administered through the County Soil and Water District offices. Uh, we were established to coordinate the efforts, communication, and outreach on water quality issues within the county. Our committee members in 2013 consisted of the Soil and Water Conservation District, the USDA Natural Resource Conservation Service, the USDA Farm Service, the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation, Cornell Cooperative Extension, Mohawk Hudson Land Conservancy, Ecos the Environmental Clearinghouse, the Skidbury River Center, uh, the Montgomery County Planning Department, and members of the community. In 2013, we sponsored the annual Mohawk Montgomery County Water Quality Taste Test, which was won by Fort Plain in 2013. Uh, we participated in five environmental field days, taking the water education model to 600 fifth grade students. We purchased a new Enviroscape water pollution model that's available to all the school districts within the county. We provided funding to the County Envirothon program for the high school students. We are continuing to update our photo inventory of the Montgomery County waterways. We worked with the Environmental Clearinghouse and the Boat U.S. Foundation to create and distribute the aquatic invasive species signs around the county. We provided the educational exhibits at Fonda Fair, at the Skahari River Festival in Burtonsville, and at Sunday on the Farm. And we've maintained our Facebook page for the Water Quality Committee within the county. Our committee members also participate in the New York State DEC Mohawk River Basin Program Steering Committee, the Mohawk River Symposium at Union College, the Mohawk Valley Sustainability Working Plan Group, and the Mohawk River Watershed Coalition of Conservation Districts. And that's our annual report. Thank you. Any questions from the legislature? Okay, thank you very much. See everybody next year. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Um, approval of the minutes of the previous meetings. Uh, we need to sponsor in a second. I'll sponsor. Ryan? I'll second. Barbara? Any additions, deletions, corrections? Everything good? All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain. That carries. Uh, approval of the budgetary transfers. We need a motion. Uh, sponsor in a second. I'll Barbara? I'll second. Alex? Discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain. That carries uh, unanimously. Unfinished business, any? No. No one? Hmm? Under new business, we have resolutions and then other. First resolution we have uh, up for discussion is Resolution 52. It's a resolution amending the 2014 operating budget. Sponsors were we were Beniac. Discussion on 52. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain? Carries. Resolution 53 is a resolution amending the 2014 operating budget with forfeiture monies. Uh, sponsors, Wheeler and Kuchis. Discussion on 53. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain? That carries unanimously. 54 is a resolution amending the 2014 operating budget, Montgomery County Bus Transportation System. Sponsors, Beniac, Duchesse. Discussion on 54. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain. 
carries. Resolution 55, resolution adopting introductory local law A of 2014, a local law establishing a county planning board in Montgomery County. Sponsors, Beniac Duchesse. Discussion on 55? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain. That carries. Okay, so. 56, resolution amending 2014 operating budget, Board of Election. Sponsors, Whites and Kelly. Discussion on 56? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain. That carries. Resolution 57, resolution amending 2014 operating budget, <coughs> Board of Elections. Sponsor, Whites and Kelly. Discussion on 57. I unfortunately Robert. missed the committee meetings. Will this cover all of the elections and the primaries and everything that's going to come forward? Terrence, Jamie, could you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Okay. Good. Any, any further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Aye. Abstain? That carries. Resolution 58 is a resolution appointing member Montgomery County Court Law Library Board of Trustees. Uh, sponsors were Whites and Kelly. Discussion on 58. It's a typographical error. I don't believe the word court belongs in the title. It's just the Montgomery County Law Library. All right, can we consider that a typo? Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, by the way, the appointer is appointee would in this for everyone who doesn't have it, would be Legislator Wheeler. Any further discussion on 58? I just want to thank you. I've loved serving on this board, so thank you very much. We didn't vote for you yet. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against? Abstain? That carries. Uh, resolution, you're welcome. Resolution 59. Resolution appointing member Montgomery County Jury Board. Again, sponsors, Whites and Kelly. Discussion on 59. Um, inserted is the name of uh, Legislator Whites. For those who, uh, we didn't have a, no, we're good up there. Any further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain, carries. Resolution 60 is a resolution appointing member to Audit Committee, Office of the Legislature. Um, sponsors, Whites, Beniac. The name that was inserted was uh, Ryan. Uh, any further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain, carries. Resolution 61, approving abstract of audited claims. Um, sponsors, Beniac, Whites. Discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against? Abstain? Carries. 62, resolution 62 is a resolution supporting intermunicipal agreement for post closure services with Schoharie and Oxego counties. The sponsors of this are Duchesse and Diamond. Discussion on 62? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain. Passes. Resolution 63 is a resolution supporting the public operation of the Montgomery County Transfer Stations. Office of the Legislature sponsors were Duchesse, Diamond. Discussion? I have a sponsored amendment that we change the wording from public to private. Um, all right, we have a. Uh, Amendment to change the word from public to private, and is there a second to that amendment? I'll second it, and I actually have some um, verbiage that I can back that up with, so that would be wonderful. Okay, we can have that part of the discussion. Yeah. Yeah, as far as the discussion, what I, um, if, if you remember at the last meeting, um, executive had handed out the public version in private. I guess my question would be to the sponsor and the second, has that changed at all? Is there anything in that that you're offering up that's changing? No. Yeah. All right, because before, if you remember, 
we were going to attach the public version to this resolution. So I was just, you know, want to make sure and be clear that it hasn't changed. And if you have something that you would like to, to hand us, that's fine, but it's not necessary. Just the whereas. Striking the resolution supporting the public to private. All right, so um, on the, uh, on this amendment, is there any further discussion? Um, hearing none, I would ask, I'd ask for a roll call. This is voting on the private. To change the title or everything else? On the amendment, yes, on the amendment. This is the amendment, the amendment changing change it to the private. word in both the title and in the resolve clause. Yes. Mm -hmm. I would expect, correct? Mm -hmm. could, you, could you just read that for everybody here? Okay, so it would say, um, resolution supporting the private operation of the Montgomery County transfer stations, private, mm -hmm. and then in the resolve it would read, resolve the Montgomery County legislature supports the private operation and the transportation associated with the Montgomery County transfer stations, and all I'm asking is that that same verbiage that was presented by the executive, if you don't mind, be attached to, because that's what we were going to do with, if it was public, um, if, if it indeed passes. And I would just... There's an extra the in there. I don't think you need the word the before transportation in the resolve clause. Right. right. Strike that out. Right, strike out the word the. Word the. Yeah, scroll call, please. Legislator Kuchis. Yes. Legislator Kelly. Pass. Legislator Quackenbush. No. Legislator Diamond. No. Legislator Whites. Yes. Legislator Beniak. Yes. Legislator Duchesse. No. Legislator Wheeler. Yes. Legislator Isabel. Yes. Legislator Kelly. No. No. I didn't count. It passed. So the amendment passes. Now we would need to vote on the resolution as, as amended. Um, all those in favor? Well, oh, discussion. Thank you. I'm sorry. <clears throat> this is a uh, this is a little disappointing to to uh, to see the support for the for the private. Um, Power. Uh, after all, we, we were all given the uh, the outline by the uh, county executive, uh, which really demonstrated basically that the costs were about equal. And uh, given that, I think there are a couple of things that we need to consider. Uh, not the least of which uh, is the fact that there are some real downsides to going with with the private sector with respect to waste hauling, and, and, and indeed in a lot of other areas. First of all, uh, typically bids come in like this. There, there's some lowballing just just as a, as a, an opening gambit. Bids are are deliberately low, and then once once an agency is in place to provide the service, uh, at the end of the contract, of course, then the situation changes. That is not uncommon at all. That is more the norm. Second, businesses are 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 in business to make profit. And uh, most certainly, we have, in this instance, where the cost is exactly the same, uh, we would be using Montgomery County tax dollars really to fund profit for, for a private business when we could be doing that work ourselves and having uh, our own employees. Um, in addition, should the time come when the business is not profitable, whether it is at the end of the contract or not, or in the middle, or someplace even in the beginning, then this, this corporation can, sim can simply not provide the service anymore. They can just go bankrupt and they're, they're gone, and we end up providing the service to begin with. And uh, that, is, that is something that I've, I've actually uh, uh, experienced. Uh, a company just <coughs> coming to me saying they have more money to, con to continue operation. Um, I've, seen, I've seen that in the past also. So there are many, many downsides. I've seen, I've seen the, and again, I, I, would, I would remind the, the legislators here that the costs were the same, 
And uh, what does that mean when, when we say we cannot um, provide this, this service that, that Montgomery County employees cannot do this? I mean, I think, I think there's, a certain, there's a certain assumption here that, that is being made here that, that they're not worthy of, of doing, doing the work. There's, there's this downside. It's certainly been implied, and I've seen some of the emails that, that have been out, out there. I, 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 I thought uh, one of them that used the, used the word big business, I thought was, excuse me, big uh, government, I thought was, was particularly inappropriate because the implication there is that it would be something that is bloated or wasteful. We've already seen that the cost is going to be approximately the same. So if you take into context the, the argument that the cost is the same with, in, with either, I don't see the justification for, for going the private route and, and not, the, not the public route. Thank you. Any other discussion? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Thank you. I'm sorry. Um, not only is the cost not the same, but it would be dramatically more. That and this would be creating a dynasty. And I think in 2012, the people were very clear that they wanted to consolidate government. And I will not support growing government. I think that we had three months to do this. So this is the wisest thing that we can do. Um, we were presented with options. And we have to do the best with a bad situation. So being told that this is cost neutral is false. Um, I'm not in the garbage business, so I don't really like garbage, personally. Um, I support Montgomery County constituents, and that is who put us here. I am not going to create a dynasty, and that being said, um, I think this has been massively discussed. Um, I'm not going to get up on a soapbox. I thank you so much. Um, I guess I'm, I'm just really disappointed uh, when I read each and every one of your bios uh, when you were running for election. Uh, you all said that you wanted to create, maintain jobs in Montgomery County by using the public sector, using county employees. You're doing that. You wanted to create business in Montgomery County by using the public sector. You're doing that. It's. Uh, when I look at the numbers over 10 years by the public, the county doing it, I see uh, a savings in near, if not more, $3 million over the 10 years uh, after I look through uh, everything. Uh, so there's $3 million uh, that we're losing. Uh, and the other part, uh, as uh, my colleague, uh, Rich Sir Jesse said, so all the county money, all the tax money, now the profit is all headed out west to Jordan instead of staying here in the county. The, the county work workers did it. Uh, they live here in the county. They buy their house here. They go to school here. They spend their money here. We get sales tax from them. Now uh, Buffalo will uh, be, getting us, be getting our money. So I'm truly disappointed. Uh, I wish you, you know, lived up to your, you guys lived up to your campaign promises and uh, did the right thing here. But uh, just one voice. Alex. Um, just to clarify, you know, I did a lot of, uh, a lot of, cons uh, how do I describe it? Um, considering a lot of the facts, um, <clears throat> talked to Matt Austin for, had previously had conversations with Dennis Heat. Um, they were both leaning toward private, privatizing this this, uh, this effort. Um, <clears throat> one of the things that we're really concerned with is we have, we have to start handling this May 1st. I don't think we should rush into deciding what this new solid waste uh, pu public entity is going to look like. Um, I just don't think there's enough time. I think we need at least a year. So to address, I guess, everybody's concerns, I'm actually in favor of eventually bringing this public if it makes sense. I just don't think it makes sense to rush it in and, and cram it in in such short notice. Um, as a result, it kind of addresses uh, Duke's concern about the lowball bit. I mean, if in five years, they, it, 
was a lowball bid and they want to increase it dramatically, we've already had five years to figure out how to institute it publicly. Um, as far as funding the for-profit, if you go down our audit bills list, most of the entities on there are for-profit entities. That's just it's who we buy our service or our product from. So I, I, I feel that we just shouldn't rush into judgment at this time, that's all. Okay, anyone else wishing to, Mr. Chairman, just briefly like to address some of the points that were made. Go ahead. <clears throat> It certainly, I don't think to characterize an argument is to, is to make an argument. And I think that uh, calling the, uh, the, the public proposal of uh, creating a dynasty, I think, is just hyperbolic speech and, and really has no particular relevance with respect to the discussion. And, and with, with, with respect to, to lowballing the bid, if, if this bid is low and the, and the company cannot work with it, You'll see, you'll see midterm that, that they'll either request an, a, an increase or, or they will go out of that business. And one final point that wasn't, that wasn't raised uh, before is, is I, I saw that, that there was some, uh, some due diligence uh, on checking the references that, that were submitted. But it really was for a different company and, and for a company. The company has not been in existence that long. The incorporation has been very short. Thank you. Okay, any further? Just one more. Quick point. <clears throat> um, it, it, you know, Fulton County has probably one of the most successful landfills in the state uh, for their size. And uh, they have a successful transfer station. And they, they use their own employees to monitor that. Uh, it, it, their employees are in the best interest of the county mo monitoring those things. So I would just like to point that out. Um, and, and, uh, also, as far as uh, a model uh, for developing a solid waste group, the model's already in place. Uh, the, mo the model is uh, MOSA. And uh, obviously, even in, uh, um, one of the things mentioned, uh, even in the model that was presented, there was some fat there that we could cut down on. So, um, you know, if, if what you're saying you want to uh, have a private hauler for a year and then we're going to do it, uh, I could support something like that. But, as of right now, I would uh, could only support uh, the, the uh, public uh, operating our landfill. The uh, on the other point too is, uh, in also uh, in uh, <coughs> reference to what Legislator Duchesne said, uh, obviously they were the low bid. Uh, after further negotiation, they knocked another hundred and some thousand dollars off. And if they decide to pull out, um, what what we have is a five thousand dollar bond. $5,000 bond costs them 150 bucks a year, so I don't think they're really too concerned about the bond. Thank you. Anyone else wishing uh, <clears throat> to speak? Any further discussion? Joe? I've been on the edge on this. I haven't decided, I haven't really decided which way to go. I probably will make the decision, but I've never seen uh, 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 government do anything better than the private sector. I'm sorry. I feel that way. I've always worked in the private sector. Uh, private sector works to make a profit. Profit government can just retax. So my, that's the way I feel. I feel that you're doing the best thing at this point. We'll see how it goes. There's nothing that says we have to be locked into it for for eternity and two or three years. If it's not working out for us, then we can look about what we have to do at that point. Okay. That's the way I feel. Everyone had a chance. All right, on the uh, resolution as amended, roll call. Alex started. Alex. No, Legislator Duchesse is the sponsor. Legislator um, Duchesse. No. Legislator Wheeler. Yes. Legislator Isabel. Yes. Legislator Kuchis. Yes. Legislator Kelly. Yes. Legislator Quackenbush. No. Legislator Diamond. No. Legislator Whites. Yes. Legislator Beniak. Yes. Pass. Resolution 64. Resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature 
adding Article 1, Section 1, 2A. Sponsors, Kelly Beniak. Discussion? Chair. Sure. Uh, again, uh, you know, I don't know. Going back to the campaign, uh, the people uh, wanted to see this as a united board, obviously. <laughs> Uh, it's not shown that often, but I think this would uh, create a divide, and uh, I would uh, not support something like this. Any further discussion? All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Aye. Roy's against. Uh, abstaining? No one? Resolution 65, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, adding Article 1, Section 1. One two B, uh, Kelly and Whites were the sponsors. Discussion. Hearing none. All those in favor. Aye. 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 Against. Abstain. Carries. Resolution sixty six. Resolution amending standing rules of procedure. The Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article two, uh, Rule nine. Kelly Whites were the sponsors. Discussion on sixty six. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain. That carries. Resolution number 67, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article 2, Rule 11, Number 4. Uh, Kelly and Whites, discussion on 67. I'd like Martin. to propose an amendment. Um, we traditionally have done a moment of silence, uh, and in the current status, uh, the way it reads, we it's not in our uh, rules and procedures, so I would like to amend this to read um, Article 2, Rule 11, Number 4, um, Moment of Silence. Uh, number 5 will be changed as follow. The privilege of the floor, including special presentations from the executive department, commissioners, or outside agencies, and then the sub subsequent numbers would change it. Is there a second? A second. All right. Discussion on the amendment. Um, I just have, I want to clarify one point. On, the, on that resolution 65, I, I want to change my vote to a no. I, I was on the wrong resolution when I was reading it. 65. 65? That's the one that Roy voted against. No, that's Can we finish this one first then in the screen? Oh, okay. this resolution. We have a we have an amendment, right? We were good with the amendment. So now we're voting on 67 as amended. Am I, am I correct? Am I correct? Yes. Yeah. Okay, as amended. Resolution 67. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstain? Now I want to take a break for just a second. Not not a real break. Just a. Uh, 65. Oh, wait a minute. No. Must be 64. 64, I'm sorry. All right, I just want to make sure we have the right one, and, and uh, I want to give Cheryl a chance to back up if she can. It was resolution amending the standing rules of procedure, adding Article 1, Section 1, 2A, okay? And was that, can you just verify that's the one, because I think you're, yes, that's right. That was the one that Roy had voted, so Alex wanted to change his vote to no. All right, still passes. Mm -hmm. There's no other, everybody good? All right. Resolution 68, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature adding Article 2, <coughs> Rule 11B. <coughs> Sponsors were Kelly Duchesse. Kelly and Duchesse. Um, I don't believe we took the vote after that resolution was amended. That, that's what I asked. You said we amended it, and then I said, did we amend it? You said yes, and then I said, everybody good? And you. But we then, the resolution as amended? Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was unanimous. <laughs> Just to clarify, 67. Is everybody good with 67? It was it unanimous? I don't want to, maybe I yes. did screw up. Yes. I, I Both on the amendment and on the resolution right. as amended. Everybody's good. Okay, 68, discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Against, abstain. 
carries. Resolution 69. Resolution amending standing rules of procedure in the Montgomery County Legislature, adding Article 2, Rule 14, Number 9. Again, sponsors were Kelly and Duchesne. Discussion on 69. This is dividing the question. Okay. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Yes. Abstain. That carries. Six. Uh, I'm sorry. Seventy. Resolution amending standing rules of procedure. The Montgomery County Legislature adding Article Two, Rule 14A, Office of the Legislature. Uh, sponsors were Kelly and Whites. On seventy. Is there any discussion? Hearing none. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain, carries. Resolution 71, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, Article 2, Rule 18.5. Sponsors, Kelly and Whites. Discussion on 71. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain, that carries. Resolution 72, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislators. Um, should that say legislature? Should, yes, yeah, legislature. legislature. Uh, Article 2, Rule 18B. Sponsors were Kelly and Chessie. A discussion on 72. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain, that carries. Resolution 73 is a resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature. Changing Article 4 or 5. Four. I guess confused. <laughs> Rule 29. Hey, Whites and Duchesne were the sponsors of 73. Discussion? <clears throat> Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain, that carries. 74, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article 4, Rule 29B, Whites, Kelly. Were the sponsors. Discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain, that carries. Uh, resolution amending standing rules of procedure, this is number 75, of the Montgomery County Legislature changing Article 4, Rule 29D. Sponsors were Kelly and Duchesne. On 75, is there any discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstain, Carries. Resolution 76, resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article 5, Rule 31. Sponsors were Kelly and Beniak. On 76, is there any discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstain? Carries. Uh, resolution 77 is a resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature. Uh, further changing Article 5, Rule 31. Sponsors were Kelly and Duchesne. Discussion on 77? Hearing no discussion. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstaining? Carries. Resolution 78 is a resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of Montgomery County Legislature, Article 5, Rule 31.1. Sponsors were Kelly and Duchesne. On 78, is there any discussion? Hearing no discussion, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstaining? Carries. Resolution 79 is a resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature changing Article 5, Rule 31.2. Sponsors were Kelly and Whites. Discussion on Resolution 79? No discussion. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against, abstain, that carries. Resolution 80, resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article 5, Rules 31.2 and 31.3. Sponsors were Beniak and Whites. Discussion on Resolution 80? Should it be called physical services instead of general services? Mm -hmm. Uh, well, we haven't reached That's that resolution yet. But. It was the resolution. Oh, before. was it? Okay. Yeah. True. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Any other discussion on 80? Oh. 
Right, right. <clears throat> I'm guessing this has to do with uh, uh, like liability insurance, uh, things, anything outside of health insurance. And uh, uh, my feeling is because it, it, the insurance for the entire county it should remain under uh, finance, or I would support that it would remain under finance. But, uh, I don't, uh, not, not sure what the, why it would be under general services. I missed the committee meeting, so I don't know if you had an explanation about that or um, know anything about it. Uh, just off the top, it doesn't seem to make sense to me. But that's my comment. You can, you can move on. I, I, I missed the committee meeting also. Could somebody? I'm sorry, what was, what was the question? Um, what, what the intent was or what the, the uh, reasoning is to move uh, liability or any non-employee insurance that involves the whole county away from finance and into general services. I can answer. Go ahead. There. The general practice has been throughout other counties to have it under general services because it's mostly property and assets. So hmm. that's usually where it falls. So we're doing a, a corrective measure. I think also, and Paul could help me out, especially during the floods, you were like the go-to guy because it was all about uh, the insurances and coverages that we had for buildings, for vehicles, for, I mean, that's what a bulk of it was, right? Uh, correct. Okay. Um, right. And I just compare likewise, employee <coughs> insurance doesn't fall under finance. I believe it falls personnel. under personnel. Right. Okay. Any further discussion on 80? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against? Abstaining? That carries. 81. Resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article 5, Rule 31.3. Sponsors were Kelly and White. Discussion on 81. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstain? That carries. 83, Resolution 83 is amending standing rules of, <coughs> I'm sorry, 82. Resolution 82 is amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, further changing Article 5, Rule 31.3. Sponsors were Kelly and White. Discussion on 82. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against, abstaining, that carries. Resolution 83 is a resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature adding Article 5, Rule 32.1. Sponsors were Kelly and White's. Discussion on 83. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against? Abstaining? That carries. Resolution 84. Resolution amending standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature uh, changed it. Um, changing, changing. changing Article 5, <coughs> Rule 35, Office of the Legislature. This I would need, uh, I added this, and I will sponsor it and need a second to discuss it. I'll second. Okay, Barbara, I'll sponsor you second. Um, Cheryl, 84 we added because, can you give us the input? I, it was the add-on. I can explain it if Cheryl would like. Yeah, go there ahead. Was consistency yeah. yeah, there's uh, Rule 35 currently uh, yeah. references County Law Section 450, Subsection 1, which does not exist. So we're getting rid of that and leaving the language as such. Okay. Uh, any further discussion on 84? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against? Abstain? Carries. Resolution 85 is a resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, adding Article 5, Rule 39A. Sponsors were Kelly and Veniak. Discussion on 85. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Against? Abstain? 
That carries. Resolution 86 is a resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, adding Article 5, Rule 42A. Uh, sponsors were Kelly and Beniak. Discussion on Resolution 86. Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstain? Carries. Resolution 87. Uh, resolution 87 is a uh, resolution amending the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature, changing Article 5, Rule 47. Sponsors were Kelly and Duchesne. Are there any discussions on 87? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstain? Carries. Resolution 88 is a resolution adopting the standing rules of procedure of the Montgomery County Legislature. And that resolution is sponsored by Whites and Kelly. Is there discussion on 88? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Abstain? That carries. That is the end of our resolutions. Under other, under new business, is there anything under other? Roy. I just had a clarification. I was uh, absent. Um, uh, last meeting when uh, the casino was brought up and uh, reading the articles in the recorder and leader, uh, they implied, uh, the leader more so than the recorder, that uh, I wasn't in favor of it and I just wanted to clear the air and say uh, this is something that I've talked about for a long time. Um, yeah, it was part of my campaign platform. Um, had many Facebook discussions about it. Um, talked uh, on a regular basis about it, and in fact uh, sponsored the resolution um, supporting the casino. And I know it's, if we have a chance of getting it, uh, that public support is important. Um, and I just wanted to uh, clear the air on this. I don't see the newspapers, the resolutions, so they can see that I did sponsor the resolution. Um, and I think uh, that, I, well, first of all, I wanted to thank Ken Rose and his group for all the hard work they've done on this. And um, it's very, be very important to the county. Uh, they estimate that the impact, the yearly impact would be 10 to $11 million a year. And to put that in some sort of perspective, the amount of money we raise by tax every year is 26.3 million. So it's, uh, it's, it's serious stuff. So I just wanted to clear there. Thank you, Chair. Okay. okay, anything else to come before us? I look for a motion to adjourn. Barbara? Martin? All those in favor? Aye. 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 Yes? We are adjourned. Aye.